here from Ohio Cash Flow. I hope you're all well. Your favorite Australian and the real Stan Dingo. Bringing you the yellow ladder tip of the day. And today I want to talk to you about this. Why you shouldn't finance your first few deals in real estate, okay? Now, disclaimer, this is just my perception, opinion, and it's based on previous experiences that I had. I strongly believe that you should build the foundations of your portfolio, okay, with cash only properties for as long as you possibly can, okay? So it doesn't matter how long it takes, look at buying the first one, two, three, four, or five properties with cash. Now why I'm saying this is because once you build a strong foundation of properties that are unencumbered, which means they have no loans on them, okay, you will be able to cover any losses that might occur in the future on any leveraged properties that you decide to buy. Okay, let me give you an example. If you buy two or three properties from a higher cash flow, then I'm giving myself a little bit of a plug, you're going to generate around $1,500 to $2,000 per month in passive income, which is around $24,000 per year, alrighty? Now, after that, if you decide to buy two or three properties that are leveraged, okay, and if God forbid something happens to one of those properties, it becomes vacant and you don't have a tenant for three months, but you still have to pay your mortgage, right? You will have enough of a buffer from the cash properties, which are generating cash flow every single month to cover, okay, the expenses, the mortgage on the property that is vacant without it affecting your lifestyle. Does that make sense, guys? So besides that, um, as most of you are aware, a higher cash flow is not willing to take on investors that are looking to finance their first few deals. It's very unfortunate that we have decided to go down this path, but it's just something that we had to do because the lenders are dragging things out too long and it's just not sustainable or feasible for us to wait six to eight weeks to close on a basic transaction and I'm really not in the mood to deal with some stupid ass underwriter, excuse my rawness there, that gets paid eight and a half bucks an hour and that takes two weeks too long to shuffle paperwork, alrighty? That's pretty much it. So hey, if you want more information about us and what we do, please go to www.ohiocashflow. Follow us on social media. Now, if you want to become a part of um, Ohio Cashflow and buy a property from us, you have to... Oh, you can go to www.ohiocashflow.com. You have to check out the description <laughs> in this video. There's a link to our investor application form. Alrighty, click on the link. Fill out the questionnaire and one of our friendly staff will be more than happy to get in contact with you. Once again, I'm Angela Ramora, the real estate dingo. Dingo, dingo, dingo. Dingo, 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 dingo. Thanks for watching.